The federal government has directed the Nigeria Customs Service to ensure ease of doing business along land borders across the country with a view to addressing the current food crisis. This was announced by the Comptroller General of the Nigeria Customs Service, Adewale Adeni, during his visit to Kongolom border community in Katsuna State. Abdullahi Yamadi tells us more. Addressing concerns over food insecurity facing many Nigerians, Adeni said the federal government has, among other measures, directed the service to release food items and other seized commodities across the borders to the people. The customs boss also asked business communities in Katana and other northwestern states to take advantage of this opener in addressing hunger and hike in the prices of food as well as other essential commodities facing the nation. However, seeks the cooperation of residents, business community and other security agencies in Katana to enable the good intentions of the government work effectively and efficiently. I've given a very firm assurance that if they continue to remain peaceful this way, if they see themselves as uh, uh, as agents of peace, of economic development and security, uh, we will very soon kickstart the process that will lead to the reopening of those borders that are closed. With this, the Controller General also directed the removal of all customs checkpoints along various roads leading to and from border communities to achieve the desired objective assuring that men and officers of the service will continue to diligently man border posts. Traders and other stakeholders expressed appreciation for the new development, assuring commitments in working closely with the service and other security agencies in fine-tuning businesses across the region. Because we are Nigerians, we, if we are, to say that we are, when the first citizens and we have, we have duty to cooperate with them to ensure law and order, then we should not cooperate with anybody that is smuggling. But we believe that those people were not smuggling anything. And what they were moving with were local commodities. We really very much want these borders to be open. It's going to provide so many jobs and there will be a lot of business to us. Not just only that. We want the Nigerian government to approve imports to the inland borders. Adeni also paid a visit to the former Nigeria's president, Muhammad Buhari, and the Emir of Dora, Farouk Umar, where he briefed them about the new policy aimed at rejuvenating the nation's economy. Border communities in Kazana State have suffered serious setback as foods and other essential commodities were restricted from reaching them over the last eight and a half years, a situation that caused a lot of economic dislocations. Observers are saying the long-awaited commitment is coming too little too late as uncontrolled inflation and continuous devaluation of the Naira may hinder government's intention of achieving the purpose it was meant for. Abdullahi Ismail Yamadi, Trust Television News, Kazana.